happy vlog <laughs> happy monday i don't know where i was going with that one i am gonna get back into my weekly uni vlogs i think i mean i'm not 100 percent sure what i'm gonna do like i don't know what people like i don't know if they like these or not so let me know because it gives a bit of an insight into uni but they do get a bit repetitive so maybe i won't do them like every single week just they get very repetitive as my weeks are literally the same um it's literally the exact same thing happening the only thing that's different is at the weekend so yeah good morning everyone happy monday i've just um got my cereal got some weetabix here and i left my water bottle at home which isn't great whoops but i've also got a flask of tea because i'll have some now and then i'll take some with me but it is minus five today it is freezing i'm gonna be going in a tracksuit and a coat i think like a tracksuit with a coat over the top but it's 8 a.m at the moment my first lecture is at nine um but they've actually changed the building so it's actually like well it says it's a 10 minute walk away but i know full well it's like 15 and so it's a lot further than the other one and also it's up two flights of stairs which isn't ideal but it's fine um yeah that's my today got two hours there i've actually got a new lecturer which is going to be weird and then i've got one hour after that so today's a really simple day but my goodness it was so hard getting out of bed this morning but i'm feeling good new year this is our first lecture of the new year i would say exciting but i'm not looking forward to it so guys i'm ready to go now i've got this white fox tracksuit on just because it's freezing and i'm gonna put this um gilet on with it because it kind of goes perfectly so yeah that's what i'm gonna wear i did actually ask for the matching shorts for my birthday to this tracksuit because then i can wear it in summer as well which would be cute but yeah i'm gonna go now because it's 22 it's only 10 minutes away as i said but it's up like two flights of stairs so i thought it's better to get going so First day of uni. Let's go. It's a shame I don't have any water, but I've got a cup of tea, that's fine. Off we go. Oh my god, I'm freezing. It's so cold. My nails match my track suit. Cute. Hey guys, so I just got back from my first lecture. I know it looks like I haven't moved. But it's like, what time is it? It's 11 o'clock, so my next my next lecture is at, well, it's 10 past 11. And um, my next lecture is at 12. So I've only got like 15 minutes. <laughs> well, like 20 minutes until I need to leave. What I normally do is like come back <clears throat> and have lunch, but I'm actually really not hungry. I think because I had some crisps last night i wasn't like hungry um this morning when i woke up and i only had breakfast like three hours ago so i'm just gonna put some friends on and i'm gonna do some work because we've just been told that we've got a presentation next monday which is a bit rubbish so um yeah that's annoying but i'm gonna do the work for it now just so that it's done and then everyone else can do their part but yeah that's what i'm gonna do now and then go to my next lecture which yeah it's a 20 minute walk away so i do need to i need to leave in literally like half an hour that's literally given me no time oh my god it's such a long walk i really built up a sweat <laughs> um no, I'm joking, it's because of the stairs. Anyway, I'm back from my second lecture. Lovely little hour long lecture. Awful, it was disgusting. No one had any idea what we were doing. So that's always a good sign, but it's one o'clock now. I might have some food. Um, just got off the phone with Alicia. And she said she's going to come down. Whoops, nearly said where I am. Cut. She's gonna come down and see me today um, with her flatmate because they haven't gone back to uni yet. And 
they're kind of close actually and need something to do so yeah cute um i need to take my jumper off because it is boiling okay so um alicia is actually here <laughs> whoops i was in bed and i was just messaging uh, messaging i was doing my editing and i did not realize that she was here whoops but yeah she's bought her like flatmates well my hair is just poofing up when it gets to like this stage it just goes poofy um i'm gonna message her and see if it's cold though because i don't really want to be cold walking around i'm gonna go shopping now she's already gone shopping because obviously i'm late oops but i need to message her and see how cold it is because i don't really know what to wear okay i'm just gonna wear this i've just put this on but i think i might be a bit cold because like earlier i had a hoodie and a gilet on I might wear a coat um sheen pl2 by the way okay i've gone for this instead i know it looks the same but this one's like way thicker and it has pockets so um jordan's sheen plt and sheen cute and i'm gonna go find them now so guys i completely forgot to end the vlog i'm really really sorry uh, end the vlog what am i going on about i completely forgot to vlog it's because i'm editing a video at the moment and i also forgot to end that vlog i don't know why i keep saying that anyway i'm just currently watching love island i'm really sorry about the lighting it's awful i'm just watching love island while i play a bit of call of duty and i'm also editing a video at the same time look at me doing four things at once vlogging Call of Duty, editing the video, watching Love Island, doing everything. But yeah, Alicia's obviously gone. Um, I didn't really vlog anything. I'm sorry, I haven't vlogged in so long. I think since I left to go meet her. But I've also had dinner. I had some tomatoes on toast for din -dins. That's all I really have to say. Hello guys, I've just um, watched that Love Island um i'm now all up to date which is good because it means i can go watch um with my flatmate now which is fun um because we're both like on the same episode so we can watch it live anyway um i'm gonna watch basically me and george each night we like try to watch something together so i'm gonna go and get my cup it what time is it it's nine o'clock so i'm gonna go and get my cup of tea now and get ready to watch something so i think we're gonna call in a bit i might actually do a little workout i know that sounds ridiculous because that's just it's not really very me i'm not gonna lie but i want to basically try and i say lose weight i don't want to lose weight i don't really care if i lose weight or not if I lose weight in the process, brilliant, but I'm not aiming to lose weight. I'm going to try and do the same ab workout every other day and the same, like, thigh workout every other day and basically just try and tone myself up a bit. So, like, I'm freezing cold at the moment. That would be a good way to warm myself up. I know it's awful. Like, I don't want to do it at all. I'm not going to lie to you. I really don't. But I'm going to call him in about... 20 minutes that kind of gives me the perfect amount of time go do a little workout go have a shower and then um make a cup of hot choc so that's cute i'm gonna do a lab workout now i don't have any weights or anything but just like body weight exercises that's what i used to do in the gym actually i used to use a weight in the gym i also need to get new um batteries for these because that is running out but yeah that's what i'm gonna go do now i might time lapse it depend depending on what i end up wearing <laughs> hey guys so somehow i lost my beauty blender um it's the next day by the way but literally can't find it anywhere and i like put mascara all over mascara put concealer all over my face um and then lost it so i'm using this to blend it in but um, doesn't look like it's blending to me i'm not gonna lie so that's not ideal but i'm leaving in like two minutes probably should have already left to be honest but oh well um it's just only because i don't know where the building is that's why i should have left but it's a five minute walk so i'm actually kind of early because i said i'd leave at quarter two and it's quarter two now 
So I actually have plenty of time. I just wanted to make sure I was there. But yeah, I'm gonna go now. Oh, out for the day. T-shirt um, from Sheen. Lounge joggers. And I'm gonna put the lounge top on as well. And maybe a jacket. Outfit of the day, lounge tracksuit with a white t-shirt and gilet from Sheen. T-shirt's also from Sheen. Hello guys, so I've just got back from my long, long day. You know, my six hour long day. Just got back and um, we got a message saying the water's off and I was like, no, that's not, that's not okay. It's not happening. So I'm going to go and have a shower <laughs> because I'm not going to lie, I just... Um, I went to wash my hands and the water was working so i'm like hmm well the water's on so i'm gonna really quickly have a shower now before they like turn it off because that's what i imagine they're gonna do but i thought i'd just show you some stuff that i got oh <laughs> my breakfast is still there oh my god stop it don't even talk to me about my breakfast basically i have um either chocolate weetabix every morning or i have marmite on toast and this morning i was like right i'm gonna have marmite on toast and then guess what happened i couldn't open my marmite so i haven't been able to open my marmite for the last couple of days and <laughs> i need someone to open it for me because it's getting a bit ridiculous i need marmite in my diet to live and i know that's a bit dramatic but it's true so that really upset me but anyway so I need to eat something though because I haven't eaten since 8am and it's now 3pm although I do feel fine like weirdly fine I've gone past the point of hunger I think but anyway so I got this um water bottle because I left my one at home which is just so stupid of me but I can't go a week without water you know it's annoying though because it is already Tuesday I ordered it last night so that was stupid of me <laughs> rather than getting it on Sunday but Imagine the days when you couldn't just like order something and it would just come next day. Well, I guess you just went to the shops, didn't you? But yeah, this is really cute. Love this. So this will be the one that I leave at uni now and I'll just leave the other one at home. Really cute little thing. Then I got this. So basically my nails, I wear gel on my nails, um, but I like to do it yourself kind of gel. Um, and my mum got me a gel kit for my birth for Christmas. You will have seen on my what I got for Christmas. And um basically i brought it back to uni with me to use here i don't actually know where i've put it though i'm not gonna lie to you hmm strange but the only colors that i have are black pink gray and red and because that's it was like a christmas set so the red and the black obviously aren't really like i use the red but only for the next couple of weeks and then i'll probably not really use the black just because black's not really my color um pink i'll use and the light gray i'll use but i bought this color have a guess white because white is my favorite color to do on my nails and um thought it'd be nice coming into summer so i can also mix that not mix it but i can use it like with the pink and the gray so yeah it's always exciting and what i'll do is whenever i go home i'll redo my nails at home so then i can use the colors that are my mum's and the last thing I got is actually ridiculous. And some people are going to be like, Robin, that's a joke. But <sighs> I got two kg of Mawams. Um, I know this is going to sound weird because I think I said in this vlog that I'm starting to eat healthier. But realistically, like, I am eating healthier. Like, yesterday I had two tomatoes, um, a banana. What did I have for food? Oh, a heel pot. They're healthy. That's 26 vitamins and whatever i had for breakfast like that was healthy and then i didn't have any snacks which was hard and then today i've had a banana and weetabix with no lunch that's all i've eaten today but anyway sometimes i get really like snacky and what i'm going to start doing is have like one of these a night um when i first moved here george actually bought me a one kg mawam box and i've like i've finished it now but he got me that in September, so it lasted a very long time. So this will last me the rest of the year. Um, but they are just amazing. Like, honestly, they are the best things. When all you want is just something little or you want a bit of sugar, they are so amazing. But anyway, I've been recording for four minutes now and I need to go and have a shower, see if it works. I'm not going to wash my hair, so I've just chucked it up like this because I want to do a body wash, which is so hard in the shower because you can't move the shower head. Like it's one of those ones that stays like pointing down so i'm gonna put my little shower cap on and um yeah go have a shower so 
see you later so it worked why does my face look like that it's gonna like bright red mm, that's a bit weird hmm okay anyway oh look my um look my bite is making another appearance lovely it doesn't seem to want to go it's literally been like two weeks i want to say sorry that was my moisturizer i think it's been like two weeks since i first got it because my my cats have fleas which is great and i've probably brought them to uni with me a bit of a shame um anyway oh my god there's a brown hair in my sink I have blonde hair. Maybe that was before I got it re-dyed. I'm gonna brave it into the cold. Oh, freezing. I need to put my heating on because that's actually awful. I like being warm. Well, I don't know. I like being cold, I'm not gonna lie. But not this cold. I'm oh, I think I opened my window before I left. That was a bit stupid. I'm gonna turn my heating on to, oh, maybe not full. Maybe full blast is a bit much. I'm gonna put it on two out of four. And my room's a mess. Okay, I'm gonna do some cleaning. I'm just gonna put like, hang up my coats and things. Cause when I get in, sorry, when I'm trying to leave, I literally try everything on and then like leave it all exactly where it was. And I need to stop doing that. But I'm really tempted to get into bed. I'm not gonna do it. But I need to watch last, li last night's Love Island. I've got now from 3 p.m. to just chill. Then tomorrow I don't have to wake up, which is just a dream. Well, obviously I do, but like 12 p.m. That's okay. Oh my god, I forgot to take my necklace off to shower. But yeah, I'm just gonna have a really chilled one tonight. And it, I have got towel on, by the way. I'm not naked, but yeah. I need to clean my room and get into bed. I'm gonna put some pajamas on. I know it's 3 p.m., but I don't really care. And I'm not actually hungry to eat anything, which is a bit strange. So maybe I'll just hold out until like six because then I can have dinner. And that makes so much more sense. Like if I have like one scoop of fuel now and then some toast later, I'd rather have like three scoops of fuel for my dinner and then have like a good amount of pasta, you know? So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try a different flavor because I have two of them. I had the mac and cheese last night. I might have a spaghetti carbonara tonight. That'll be nice. Um, should we put some veg with it, shouldn't I? Except it is 26 vitamins and minerals all in there. So I don't know. Maybe I'll have a banana on the side because I've, I've got six of them. And I feel like bananas, they take a while to ripen. But then once they do, they go off within like so such a short amount of time. So like I've had two of them and I've got six to eat before I go back this weekend. Um, got birthday celebrations this weekend. Not mine. My birthday is not until the end of Feb. But yeah. Well, I'm not going to lie, I've actually got a lot of work to do. Like, not uni. Well, yeah, uni, actually. But my uni work's not due for, like, quite a long time. Quite happy about that. Like, my next due date is the 20th of Feb. Well, I've actually got... It's a bit stressful, actually, because I've got a presentation next Monday. But, like, no one's prepared for it. And I've been messaging my group, like, what are we going to do? Because it's a group project. Hate group projects, I've decided you have to rely on other people i like getting my work done in my own time but then again i would not want to be doing a presentation on my own so i don't know it's kind of good but also kind of bad um and yeah but anyway for uni um i've not got anything until like anything proper until like the 17th of Feb. but that's what i'm going to work on now i've got like a banner to make for my podcast i did make one but I'm not really vibing with it. Like I added it to my SoundCloud account and I just don't love it. So I'm gonna make a new one. Can't find my banner now. That's annoying. Oh, here it is. So I made this banner, which has the Cats Out The Bag logo and then like some stuff, but it doesn't really work. I don't like it when it's uploaded on SoundCloud. So I'm gonna do some uni now. But I also need to do some YouTube work. This is my problem because I don't know how to juggle them both. Like, it's just not easy. I really, I either go through a whole day of doing just uni or just YouTube, you know? Um, I can't really do them both. So that is annoying. Getting a bit hungry now, actually. So I might have to go and make my food now. But um, yeah, I've put on this fluffy set and I've turned on my 
heating as I said but it stinks I just hate the smell of the heating it's awful um it kind of just smells like burning the whole time you know it's not ideal and I've also put on my heated towel rail I have a heated towel rail because it dries um my towel like when I got out of the shower I just chuck it on the heated towel rail and it just dries it but that's on as well so I'm getting a bit hot Mm, might have to turn the towel rail off. Anyway, welcome to my rants. <laughs> I need to stop. Okay, I'm gonna do some work now. Good morning, guys. I feel like every clip of me in the morning is the exact same, but this one is at 11 a.m. and I'm so happy to say that I didn't have to get up until 10.45. That is the time that I'm meant to wake up in the morning, I swear. Like, I woke up and I got up straight away. When it's 7 a.m., I wake up and I'm like, I'm not getting out of bed. That's not happening. Bye. I've got a cup of tea and just a banana for breakfast. So they're still so green, which does kind of annoy me, but it's fine. I've got to eat them. Um, outfit of the day, Gymshark, Sheen, Sheen. Um, don't know where they're from, Primark and Jordans. And I'm off because I'm so late. Just finished my lecture. So just got back and... Um, Obviously, I only had like a banana for lunch, so I might make some lunch now. Or maybe I'll wait a bit, it's only one o'clock. Hey guys, so I'm back in my room. Sorry, I saw the stairwell while I was filming that and someone came in, so awkward. But um, just put some like comfier clothes on. I just like some like pajama bottoms and this t shirt because it's so comfy. And I think, I'm, well, no, I'm gonna do some work. I always say like, oh, I need to give myself time to chill. I don't ever give myself time to chill. Like my chill time is the evening. So yeah, I mean, I got up quite late today, like 10.45. I've only been up two hours. So I am gonna just do a bit of work, like uni work, because I have this presentation, I think I've said about it, that I don't really know what to do because none of my, People, it's a group project and none of the people in the group seem that bothered because it's not like marked. So it's a bit tricky. Um, yeah. Anyway, I think, let me just do some work. I've, um, I've been trying to pay more attention to my Instagram recently. I do need to start doing that. I mean, I don't know if you guys follow my Instagram, but if you don't, it's Robin. Emily with like three Y's. I'll put it up on the screen here. So yeah, I definitely think you should follow it if you want to be involved in like videos and things. But also I realized that I haven't really been focusing on like getting my followers up in like a year. Like I realized last year that it literally hadn't, like my following literally hadn't changed in a year, which is kind of awful. So yeah, that's kind of what I'm gonna focus on. Um, over the next couple of weeks, but I am just going to do my banner for my podcast. I think I said about this yesterday. That's what I need to do, and I'm going to edit the video that you guys are currently watching up to date because it's a vlog. It needs to be edited up to date. Um, watch some YouTube, and then I'll probably have lunch at like two o'clock. I've got some um, tomatoes like cut up in the fridge, so I'm going to make like bruschetta or pomodoro, um, like try and make it basically because i'm just gonna get some toast and like use the i basically made it well george made it but basically made it with um what's it called um tomatoes basil oil and salt and pepper and it tastes so good it's so fresh so i'm definitely gonna have some of that and then i might cut up the rest of my tomatoes and make some more because it's so nice but yeah i'm gonna watch some youtube and so I've just sat down to start making my podcast banner and I thought I'd put some Ellie Darby on her new Primark try on haul so it really really wouldn't be right to do it without a cup of tea so that is what I'm doing now if you guys don't know Ellie Darby get to know and get to know her with a cup of tea <laughs> oh my gosh it's 4 p.m not 4 p.m actually it's it's 20 past four I just had the, I've suddenly just got the biggest headache ever. And then I was just thinking, why on earth do I have such a big headache? Like I've been drinking water and everything. And then I thought, oh, I forgot to have lunch. I've been working so much. I forgot to have lunch. Like what the hell? I feel so faint. It's so weird. All I've eaten today is banana. 
um and it's half past four that's awful so i'm gonna go into the kitchen i'm gonna whip something up i should feel really ill okay just got out the potato croquettes they take 30 minutes to cook can i wait that long i've got to wait for it to heat up as well hmm i might just have like a snack now I don't know what to have as a snack. Hmm. Okay. Got to wait 32 minutes. That's not ideal. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know how to use the oven because these have all been wiped off. I think that that says 200 degrees, but it doesn't look very on if you ask me. So I just messaged my flatmate to ask how to use it because like, no brain. Um, literally just turned that. So it should be on. She was like, we have been here six months. How do you not know? I don't know, I don't know. Right, so it's saying one fifth of the pack is a serving. So I'm gonna work it out. I need to see how many there are. I know I sound so stupid, <laughs> but I wanna make sure I have a serving my god i've been sat here thinking why is the oven not on but it was off at the wall oh my god there's actually something wrong with me <laughs> why can i not do anything i've been sat here for about 20 minutes like why is this not working right this is the spinach mix that i've got so there's four blocks of spinach in here with peppers onions garlic ginger and chili and then i'm just about to put these in the oven now that's it it's heated up so 30 minutes. So, these are my mini potato croquettes. <laughs> oh, it's ridiculous, but I don't have a tray. They're probably not gonna cook like that, are they? Hmm. But, oh well. Only issue is I really don't know how they look, how long they've been in there for. So, I might just leave, come back in 20 minutes. Check them. Just to give like a context of how long that's taken, it was 10 past um, four, or was it 20 past four? I think it was 20 past four when I went into the kitchen and it's now five. That's literally taken me 40 minutes and it's not even cooked. I should be eating my food right now. So what I'm gonna do is have some Mauams to tide me over because I feel like I deserve them. I'm so unbelievably hungry. I can't believe I managed to miss lunch, but it's looking good. You know what, I'm gonna have a cherry no, okay. You know what my favourites are? The raspberries. I'm going to have a raspberry, an apple and an orange one. Okay, it's been about 15 minutes, so I'm going to go back in now and start like frying up all my veg. It's literally been an hour since I started cooking this, but they're looking good. And just getting ready to fry all this up. I really want some jalapenos, but I can't open it. Oh my God. I literally, I don't understand. I used to be like strong. <laughs> I literally can't do it. I'm not joking. It's like not budging at all. I can't do it. Great. Okay. Gordon Ramsay, come for me. This is the first meal I've had with um, a knife and fork since I've been here. I'm a bit worried it might be a bit dry because I don't have any mayo but this looks good good morning guys it's thursday while i'm filming this i am just um it's actually thursday morning um i have a lecture at 11 but i naturally woke up at nine which is so weird i set my alarm for 10 and i naturally woke up at nine so i was like hmm, who's this girl so i was like okay well i'm gonna have a shower now because i was gonna have a shower this evening but like the sooner the better in my eyes like what's happened there like i wanted to have a shower um and wash my hair last night so i was like okay i'll just do it this morning 
but now i only have an hour until i've got to go because it is now 10. um it kind of took a very long time well it's 10 to 10. at 10 to 10. yeah yeah 10 to 10 but i've already made my breakfast and everything and i wouldn't even be awake yet so i feel like i'm still ahead of schedule but i need to just blow dry my hair because i can't go to a lecture like this hey guys so i've dried and straightened my hair and today i'm gonna film a video which is gonna be everything i've bought in 2023 so oh I, actually that might be a bit stupid i was gonna say like clothing wise but i haven't really bought much uh maybe i'll do a primark haul but i'm gonna film something today um yeah i'll do a primark haul because i've got loads of things here from primark that are just amazing so i am gonna put a bit of makeup on um this is a pencil from brow this way what brand is this rimmel i'm not gonna lie it's not great i prefer this one i love 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 from primark but it's like not been sold there for so long so i'm gonna go into primark today i might film a what's in primark and then do a primark haul like ellie darby does you know my queen ellie darby i love her so maybe i'm gonna do that but i'm gonna go to i'm going to iceland straight after my lecture because i've got to get some frozen stuff and then i will go to primark and see if there's anything that i want to purchase and if not then i've got a lot of stuff here anyway um that i need to do so yeah i'm gonna film a what's new in primark oh this is so like spontaneous I write down all the videos I make just to keep track um, and then it reminds me to make them and also reminds me that I've actually filmed them because sometimes like when I film things on my phone instead of my camera so like when it's a vlog I film on my phone just because the quality is literally not even that much different and also it's easier like walking around with the phone walking around with the camera you know security guards get a bit suspicious if you walk around with the camera um but yeah, so when it's on my phone, I sometimes like forget to edit the stuff. Also, I can't put much concealer on because basically I've lost my beauty blender and I have no idea where it is. And Alicia, if you're watching this, did you like steal it or something? Because basically it just disappeared and I'm just so confused where it went. Because like I had it on Monday and I know I did. And then suddenly on Tuesday, it's like disappeared. Who even knows? Right, I was going to say, where's my phone? I'm vlogging on it. But basically, I don't have another like, I don't have any brushes here. So I don't have a brush to like wipe it, uh, wipe it, blend it with. So I'm going to have to use my fingers. But I'm going to go into Primark today and I'm going to get a beauty blender and maybe like a brush as well. Cause i'm not gonna lie i can't like beauty blenders jump around and i can't keep losing them i lose them all the time this actually works quite well though i'm not gonna lie this is what my mum does and i always like make fun of her for it i'm like why are you using your fingers to blend in your makeup but okay i guess it works it's kind of just exactly like using a beauty blender isn't it if it does the job i don't really care so this morning i have two hours um in one lesson and then as i said i'm gonna go do that video and do this stuff get the stuff from iceland i'll probably do the iceland stuff afterwards if i'm filming a video um <clears throat> as it will take a while and then i'm gonna go and then i've got like a few hours wait and then i've got a lecture at four so I have from well i finished this one at one it's 11 till one and then i've got like well the next one at four so to be fair i'll probably only have like two hours to kill by the time i've done my shopping and everything if you're wondering what this is it's the mua bronzer it's so good like you can't just use it like on its own like you can't literally use it like that you literally have to you have to um, pat a bit off because it is so pigmented that you really, really have to blend. 
if you do put too much on although I feel like bronze is my best friend honestly if i could only have one makeup product for the rest of my life it would be bronzer i adore it it is my favorite thing especially in summer like when my skin's really clear at the moment i've got this like bite that's turned like black and i'm thinking maybe i've um it's it and it's gonna scar <laughs> that blush is from primark really good again i might actually buy one to take home with me because obviously because i'm at uni i have like some things at uni and some things at home but like most of my stuff is here you know the stuff i really like is obviously with me at uni so it's kind of difficult um yeah whoops i might actually take some track seats back home with me because i mean i have got some at home but they're just not i just highlighted my um bite that's always nice isn't it anyway that's my plan of the day i actually haven't got a clue what time it is let's see okay it's half past 10 so i've got 10 minutes to choose an outfit and get downstairs I'm not gonna put mascara on actually maybe i am do i have my cheek one yep perfect oh my god this mascara is mua this is literally it seems like an ad for mua and primark that is because their stuff is so good but so affordable i might even you know what i might do buy a makeup product from each like section of primark each section for each section of my face from primark and make a video a full face of primark makeup because then i get three videos out of just going to primark today that is what i'm gonna do sorry um, oops accidentally playing Madison Sarah. Anyway, I've only got 10 minutes to get downstairs, so I kind of need to go get dressed. But I hope you enjoyed this little clip. I'm gonna add to my little to-do for YouTube, full face of Primark. And I'm not gonna lie, I do have a lot of Primark stuff, obviously, at the moment, but I don't want to use the stuff that I already have, because obviously that's not what's in Primark at the moment. So the people watching the video, if they wanted to go buy the stuff, they couldn't. But anyway, I'm going to choose an outfit. It's four degrees. So I was thinking I'm going to wear the... I have a white fox tracksuit that's like blue. It's really, really nice. But if I'm going shopping, I might be a bit hot. I don't know. But then again, I'm not going to be running around in the shop. Like, it is still four degrees. That is cold. Maybe a tracksuit's fine. Because normally I'd wear a tracksuit with a coat or a gilet. Yeah, okay. Maybe I'll just put that on. So I only have like three minutes until I actually need to be down there. But I don't know if this is like... Can I wear this or is it just too baggy? Like, obviously I will wear it at some point, but I'm kind of the person who would wear like a long sleeve top and a jacket. I don't know if this is a bit like too baggy. I can't really decide. I'm also really, really hot, but I think that's probably because um, it's quite warm in here at the moment. Like it will be freezing outside, but like, does that look okay? I mean, I'll have my hair down as well. Oh my God, it's made a, oh no. Whoops. Okay, I think I am gonna have to go with this just because um, it's like 40 now, but does that work? You guys are probably looking at me thinking you look like you're in your pyjamas. I know I do. But I'm just basically thinking between putting like leggings on with this. So I lost out and I've gone for leggings from lounge though. So they're really comfy. <clears throat> I will wear the full thing one day. Don't worry. But for now, it's leggings and Air Maxes. And now I'm going to go meet my friend. Honestly. I swear it is the windiest place here. I just brushed my hair. Really annoys me. The sky's cute. It's actually a really nice day. Hope it doesn't start raining because like I've literally had a shower this morning. Maybe I should check the weather. Okay, I made a mistake not wearing a coat. And also made a mistake not wearing the joggers. I'm really, really cold, but that might be because of where I'm standing. Like it's a really windy, it's like a wind tunnel here. So I'm just on my way to Primark now. Hey guys, so I'm back from my little trip out. Um, I didn't actually go to Primark. Uh, no, I did. I didn't go to Iceland in the end because I don't really have space in my freezer 
so i felt like it was a bit of a stupid decision to go if i can't like store any of the stuff oh my god i'm so out of breath anyway i need to make some lunch i had breakfast earlier i had um weetabix and a banana and it's now 2 p.m i finished my lecture at one and then i did some like walking around and everything um oh my god and i'm gonna film a full face of time mark makeup won't film that today because i don't really want to put a full face of makeup on i'm not gonna lie but i'm gonna do a little haul i think of what i got i just need to put my hair up it's always so in my face and i need to right anyway I'm not going to get changed. I've got two hours until my next lecture. Like, it's four till five. So I've literally got an hour and a half, actually, because it's a 20-minute walk. So I'm literally going to eat, probably edit the video I just filmed, and then go, which is a bit rubbish. I'm not going to do any actual work. I'm just going to do YouTube filming, I think. So I'm going to do a Primark haul now for you guys, a mini one of what I just got, and then I'm going to film my actual Primark haul of the stuff I've got over the last couple of weeks but I do need to make some lunch first because I'm starving and that's a priority so I'm going to go have um, my tomatoes on toast because I was meant to have that for lunch yesterday and I didn't so that's what I'm going to go and have now that is a nice lunch okay call me chef the last couple of meals I've had I've loved the look of look at that basically all this is is toast with butter and then tomatoes, basil, onions, salt and pepper. Gorgeous. Look at it. So this is literally toast and tomatoes, you know? It's so good. You wouldn't have ever thought. Okay, that pillow. I need a bigger one. Um, literally, toast. I mean, it is incredible, to be honest. It's such a nice meal. Okay, I just finished my lunch, so I'm going to do... Um, I might put you up there. That's a bit nicer lighting, isn't it? I'm going to do my little mini Primark haul now. And then I'm going to film the other one as well. I did just call my mum, but she didn't answer. So, mum, rude. <laughs> I'm joking. So, got a little mini bag from Primark. Love Primark. Um, as I said, I went in there to buy some makeup stuff. So, I'm just going to show you the makeup bits that I got. So, I'm actually going to start with this. So, I got this perfume right because basically while I'm at uni I didn't bring any like well I bought one like real perfume with me and that's when I'm going out for the night like if I'm going out out or like if I've got a nice dinner I'll wear that but otherwise I won't wear my nice perfume because I feel like it's just such a waste um and then the other ones are literally just body mists so I thought I'd get like a perfume that smells nice why i hate these things these little sticky things there needs to be a better way to get these off because oh my gosh okay i can't open it that's brilliant basically i want to show you guys the bottle it's um the scent notes on it basically says like what the scent is like meant to smell like so it's fruity vanilla and floral which i thought was such a nice little mix and I did try it, there was a tester, goodness, I could not be doing this in a video, um, in a video, in the shop, but yeah, it's really cute, so look at it, oh my god, it's so cute, it's called Wild Azalea, ooh, did I get the right one? It's making me think I didn't get the right one, because I don't think the bottle looked like that, but how cute is that though? And this is literally five pounds for 50 mil, which I thought was really good, oh my god! Okay, that is the right smell. I don't know if you guys just saw that, but I opened the lid. It just went everywhere. Okay, I don't know how you do this. Where's the spray thing? That could have literally gone everywhere. Primark, come on. Sorry, how am I meant to use that? Is that like stuck in there? Like that's not meant to be like that, is it? I mean, it smells great come on that is so rubbish 
How am I meant to use this? Do I just wipe it on me or something? I mean, it smells delicious, but come on, I wish it would work. Right, so it's described as a warm fruity fragrance with a sweet powdery base of patchouli, vanilla and tonka bean, sharpened by the fresh citrus top notes of pear and blackcurrant. Sounds nice. Okay, so my mum did just call me back. Um, so I was just chatting to her, but I've just um, figured it out. Basically, I just opened it wrong. You're meant to just pull and I twisted it. So this twisted off with it. it smells so good though, this wild azalea stuff. Oh, so good. Five pounds. Right, what's, um, I spent 26 pounds in Primark because I know that sounds like a lot just for a YouTube video, but like five of that was that and I wanted that anyway. So I only spent 20, like one pounds for the video. Okay, let's hope it goes viral so I can make that money back because that would be a huge waste of time otherwise. Um, but I am gonna use these products probably now. I've decided I kind of want to film the video today, like before my next lecture, because I've got an hour until I need to leave so I can film two videos. So the Primark haul and then this. Um, that's what I'm going to do. It's a shame though, because I have got makeup on for the first time ever. I've actually got makeup on, that's so weird. Um, anyway, next item. So I'm going to go in price order, I think. So I got this tinted moisturiser, because as I said, I wanted to do the makeup video. This is the My Colour Perfect Tinted Moisturiser um radiant finish and it's spf 30 so i thought that'd be really good for the summer um i use it like as concealer because i don't really wear foundation um and it's five pounds so yeah that's really cute for 35 mil so i thought that was really cool and if i love it i'll obviously go back tomorrow and like stock up because primark i swear they're known for like every time i love something they take it off the market so i got this aqua lash mascara this is waterproof I don't really know how to work the focus on my phone, I'm not gonna lie. Um, Aqua Lash Mascara, waterproof mascara with vitamin E. This was £2.50. I thought it was just really cute. I like the colour of the thing as well. I only wear my waterproof mascara because I always um, wipe my eyes and then it just smudges. And also, I find that if you're going out for the night, like if you're going out clubbing, waterproof is what you need because if you're like sweating or like eyes closed, you know, like you need waterproof. Anyway, okay, the next thing, oh, that was £2.50, I don't know if I said. The next thing is this um, this brush. So this came in, this, that I've already taken all of the packaging off. So this was £2.50, contour and highlight brush. Um, suitable for vegans, which is always fun. And yeah, I thought that'd be like quite cool to use as a makeup video because like bronzer and I didn't use a brush like that for highlight to be honest but that kind of works that works um easy out as well i'm gonna basically i didn't want to have like two of everything um sorry i wanted two of everything so that i can leave some stuff at home and some at uni so that's what i'm doing i'm gonna take back my other brushes back home the next thing i got is this concealer so this is the liquid concealer medium coverage and i got this in the shade light beige um there were a few and i thought this one would be the most appropriate i mean i didn't actually test it but it looks like it looks similar it was two pounds and then i got um what else was two pounds oh this so this is another um brush set so this is the concealer and foundation brush because i couldn't find any beauty blenders in there i don't know why i don't know where they were couldn't find any so i've got this for like blending in foundation and concealer but i won't i would probably use this for concealer because i'm just i don't know i'm not a very minimalistic person like i can't do eyeshadow or anything like that i use like big stuff i like a big bronzer you know that kind of thing and oh my god i saw this bronzing brush that was huge it was for, like your body and it looked so nice and there was this like shimmer mist stuff oh i wanted it so bad but i was like i'm gonna save it for when i'm on holiday don't need it when i'm at uni then the next thing i got um <laughs> let's work our way back down in price so i got this lip gloss high gloss lightweight ultra shine lip gloss in the shade candy it's a pink one i don't normally go for pink glosses i go for like nude glosses but i thought this was really cute so for like going out and also i said i would do it for the video so there we go and then i got i actually got two of these because i love them this is kind of like similar to the brow pencil that i know and love um except it's in light brown rather than blonde and I'm not gonna lie that looks really dark so this is my trusty brow pencil i love it I normally get them in light blonde no i don't i normally get them in blonde this is light brown though 
don't know that might be okay to be fair these are one pound fifty each and i got two of them because they're always out of stock but for some reason there were loads of them in that primark so woo. then i got this blush which was one pound fifty as you can see i have this one at home as well it's high pigment blusher this one's got a bit of a shimmer in it um one pound fifty in the shade desire so yeah i just got that because you know then i can take the other one home and then i got this bronzer which is a matte bronzing powder one pound so that's a bargain and where's the brush oh my gosh i've lost the brush oh there it is you know good size i thought so yeah oh i didn't get highlight <laughs> oh my god that's the one thing i didn't get from primark and i don't have any from primark so i'm gonna have to go without that for the video but okay that's all my stuff from primark and i'm gonna film my full face of primark makeup and i think i'm gonna do one for tiktok as well like i'm gonna try and do do it like at the same time like film a primark makeup like full face of primark makeup tiktok at the same time because obviously I, I film the tiktok on my phone where i film the youtube video on my camera so i'm definitely going to keep all those things so i can throw away the receipt oh yeah i need to film my primark haul now the clothing one so i'm basically going to start like trying to drink more in my day to day by the way film the primark haul but i haven't filmed the makeup one because i i don't have time i have 20 minutes until i need to leave for my next lecture um so yeah i really don't have time because it'll be like 20 minutes like the video would probably take 20 minutes to film i could do it but it would just be rushed um i'm gonna basically try and drink more water so i'm gonna drink what's that 750 ml i don't know i don't know what size that is or is it like 500 let me have a look because i have a bottle right here with measurements on it oh so that's 500 ml so i'm gonna try and drink four of these because you're meant to drink 2,000 in a day. Yeah, so that's probably 500 mil as well because it's a bit wider. So I'm going to try and drink four in a day because I feel like that's a bit healthier. I need to start drinking more water, so. Mm. Um, the thing is, when I'm in my lectures, I don't drink much water. You'd think you would, but I don't because otherwise I will really need a wee and I can't be doing that. So, yeah. Oh, well, but me on my journey to become a healthier person. I'm eating a lot healthier as well. I'm so guys, I'm going to my next lecture now. Um, basically, the um, weather's changed. It's so much colder and it looks like it's gonna rain. So I've gone for the most basic outfit ever. Grey hoodie, leggings and a coat. Matches my bag. Coat's Primark. Hoodies, boohoo. Leggings and a lounge. But it looks like it's gonna rain, so I needed a hood. Um, and my tracksuit didn't have a hood and it's also freezing outside. Fingers crossed I'll actually be warm today. Cause well now, because this morning I was literally shivering walking to my lecture. So hopefully this will be a nice uh, warm outfit. Oh. Hey guys, I'm back. Um it smells like burning in my room, which has made me worry I didn't turn my straighteners off, but they are unplugged, so they are obviously off. Why is it so hot in here? Oh my god. I'm boiling. Okay, that's quite hot. I need to open my window. It's when I have like a coat on and I walk up two flights of stairs because obviously I'm not, well, I'm on floor one, but if for some reason it's up two flights, it gets so hot. I'm really like sweaty. A bit TMI. But um, anyway, I'm gonna sit and chill for a bit. I'm actually really hungry, which is weird because I've eaten a lot of food compared to what I normally eat in a day. I ate a half one. No, I didn't. I ate a two. So, half two. Why am I so hungry? It's five o'clock. This is so weird. Anyway, I need to clear up all my coats that I've left on the floor. Bit of a mess, but yeah, I need to do that now. I'm gonna um, take my makeup off because this has been on a while. I've had a very productive day though, I feel like. So I'm happy about that. <clears throat> I mean, to be honest, not really. I mean, to be fair, I have a group assignment next Monday. 
and I've um, done like most of the work for that. So I'm happy about that. At least I've done that. But I do need to do a little bit more. Well, actually, there's four of us. I might ask if some of the other people could do something. Oh my god, it's so loud outside. I don't know what that is. But um, yeah, I'll probably actually just ask if someone else can do it. But yeah. Anyway, that's like due on Monday. But then our real thing. This is like a practice, and then the real thing is due the day after my birthday which is awful i'm not gonna lie but um i'm gonna get the train because basically normally i get the train back but sometimes that train runs a bit late and it gets me in for 20 past nine rather than nine so i'm gonna have to get the half seven train that gets me in for nine and george has offered to drop me at the station um before he starts work so that should work quite well and then it means like it's the day after my birthday it means i don't have to go back on my birthday because that would just be awful i would hate that <laughs> that would oh my god i would hate that so much so yeah anyway i'm really happy to be back in my room i was gonna film that full face of makeup but i want to do it when i'm actually going somewhere you know it's so stupid to do it now I was gonna do it then, but then it means all the stuff's at home, which is kind of defeating the object of why I bought it. Anyway, I need to drink some more of this because that's all I've drunk today. Well, actually saying that, I'm lying to you because, I don't know if you can hear that. I've drunk this as well. So I don't know how many I've drunk, but once I've drunk both of these, then I've drunk two, I've drunk 1000 liters. No, I haven't. 1000 milliliters, <laughs> I've drunk one liter. So I'm gonna sit and if I sit with this in my lap, I will drink it. But if it's not in my lap, I won't drink it. Someone has a really cool room over there. They've got lights changing. That is so cool, rather than lights being on. To be fair, I do have a one of those colour lamp things. Anyway, so yeah, I'm going to like kind of, not pack, but like get the things that I'm taking to me, to you, to me, to home with me. I'm going to put them in a pile. I got an email from um, Protein World. It's not my protein. It's Protein World, and which is so weird because I was literally on my protein's website yesterday. Because I was thinking, right, I don't really have enough protein in my diet, and I want to get more. <laughs> because basically, I've started like I don't know if you watched my vlogs like before I went. To before I came back to uni but basically I used to like track my calories but not in like a bad way I used to basically eat what I wanted but then log it so then I could see how much I was eating and I figured out that basically a lot of it like the main section is um veg and carbs which I think it is meant to be anyway I think it's meant to be like 25% carbs 25% veg and then the rest is like protein and fat and sugar or something I don't know but I basically figured out that I'm just not eating enough protein because it said on the little line, there was a little line across it and it was like, not enough protein consumed for the day. So I guess that's what I'm gonna be doing. But that's quite cool that I've got in a club. because I'm gonna have to pay for the stuff. Right, I've just put some comfies on because it's what I live in and I've got my six mile arms of the day. <laughs> I basically, I'll have six milligrams in a day. I know it's weird, but it's because there's six flavours and I love something sweet. I won't eat all six now. Like I'll eat them throughout the evening, but it's nice to just have a little treat. So that's what I've started doing. And then it's also like in moderation. So this is probably my order of milligrams. So these are my favourite. That's probably my least favourite. Actually, no. Like that so cherry's my favorite i love the raspberry like they're probably drawn and then i also love the cola and i to be honest i love them all but like it's not that that's my least favorite i just love these so much more so i'm curious what yours is so i know that some of you might think this is the most disgusting thing you've ever heard of but i've just made my dinner i was gonna have a heel pot but basically i needed to get some protein in yes fuel has a lot of protein but I was really craving something else and the something else 
is basically my favourite meal to exist. Um, so I thought I'd make that instead. Now, <laughs> this is where you guys might be like, what is that? So I made Marmite pasta. I love Marmite pasta. It's so good. This is what it looks like with cheese. It's literally Marmite cheese and pasta. So simple. And it's so good. I adore it. So good. So if you're ever wanting to try something new, then I would recommend trying this. I just boil some pasta and then in the pan, uh, without the water, I like get rid of the water and then put like two scoops of Marmite and then cheese. It's so good. But yeah, I basically found out that Marmite actually has quite a bit of protein in, and cheese has some as well. So it's always handy and I needed to up my protein for the day. So I've had two and a half of these and I said I'd have four in the day. So I'm actually doing quite well considering I started at about 4 p.m. But yeah, um, two and a half. I might do a whole video on like drinking water if I notice a difference kind of thing. So that's something anyone would be interested in. I know it's the new year and everyone's setting goals and things, so I don't know. Also, I was wondering if anyone wanted a video on, like, my application to uni and everything. If anyone would be interested in a video on that, then I would definitely do that. Oh, my God. Good morning, guys. Wow, I'm Eric. I just woke up. Oh, my God. I am. Um, it's 9 a.m. I am not meant to wake up for another two hours, so I'm very tired, um, but my flatmate woke me up, <laughs> shouting. <laughs> God, I want to go back to sleep, but I can never go back to sleep, it's really weird. Anyway, I'm going to open my window and let some fresh air in. Um, I'm not actually hungry though, at all. So maybe I'll just go make a cup of tea and I might play online for a little bit and edit some videos. Fancy a bit of Call of Duty. Okay, I'm a bit more awake now. Oh, my throat hurts so bad. Right, well, I've just woken up and got a shower. Um, I washed my hair yesterday morning, so I haven't washed it again. I might have to straighten it again though because a few bits did get wet and they've gone a bit like wavy, which is not nice. Um. But I'm going to go into the kitchen now. Well, not now. I'm going to get dressed. Then I'm going to go into the kitchen and just um, make some tea. And then I think I'm just going to get back into bed and go on Call of Duty. I'm not going to lie to you. Except maybe I won't get in bed because otherwise I'll never get back out again. And I think it's like half nine now because I sat on my phone for a while. So I've not got too long until my lecture. I mean, it's at 12. I've got a while you know but my alarm was gonna go off at 10 45 so yeah but that gave me a whole hour to get up and awake so i've actually got like two hours so i did decide to um get breakfast and i've left the light on because otherwise i'll just fall asleep um i got some weetabix <clears throat> cup of tea and half a glass of orange juice because yeah, fancied it. And also I need to use it up because I'm going home this weekend and it runs out on Monday. So yeah, that is what I'm doing now. I am gonna take like a little bag home with me for the weekend. Like literally just like my computer and a couple other things just cause I am um, on Monday morning. If I do come back Monday, I don't know if I'm coming back Sunday or Monday yet. But if I come back on Monday, then I am um, need to go straight to my lecture from the train station so that I get there on time rather than getting there at like half nine, 20 past nine. So yeah. So guys, I know it's literally Friday in this vlog, but this video is getting so ridiculously long that I think I'm going to end it here. And then I'm going to start a new one, which is going to be a weekend vlog. Um, it's the same week I'll just post it and call it like a weekend vlog so you guys can see the rest of the week but otherwise this video is going to end up being like <clears throat> two hours long and realistically who's going to watch that no one's even going to watch an hour and a half so yeah 
I'm gonna end it here so thank you all so much for watching I hope you did enjoy this but I'm gonna start another one like right now of Friday Saturday Sunday so you guys can definitely watch that if you like um but yeah thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video bye